regard this life as a Shakespeare's brief candle, but rather as a flaming torch which I've been privileged to, to carry for a great many years. And I'm now ready to pass it on. Well, I've always loved the theatre, but um, never thought of acting as something that I would or could do. I have worked as my father drank. He had the drink craze. I had the work craze. My name is Paddy O'Keefe. I'm an Irish actor based here in Brighton. Um, and I have, over recent years, become increasingly interested, fascinated, some of my friends say obsessed, with Bernard Shaw. Today is the 27th of July, 1946, my 90th birthday, and I'm so pleased that you've all come. The reason I got into acting in the first place was because of being involved in the, in the peace movement, and I decided what I wanted to do was stuff that was either political or Irish. Uh, and there weren't too many parts around, and I realised that Bernard Shaw was both Irish and extremely political, so he was a, an absolute character. Well, you'll never find an Englishman in the wrong, because everything he does, he does out of principle. Well, yeah, I mean, Dublin is my hometown, and Shaw was born and brought up in Dublin, lived there till he was 20. And as a lad growing up in Dublin, I automatically assumed that I knew a lot about Shaw because he was around. I mean, I went for an entrance exam in the, in the street where he was born, Sing Street. Um, I never went to that school, which is just as well, but that's another story. And I also realised that when something is really funny, there's usually a truth in it. I'd read a lot about him uh, as part of my research and decided that what I, need, what, what I was thinking of in my head was a, a one-man show where I would play Bernard Shaw. I was very enamoured of William Morris's daughter May. And on leaving their house one evening, I saw her framed in the doorway and a communication emanated between us. Uh, and also there was the fact that he was a painfully shy man who created this extraordinary, extravagant um, persona so that he could get his views across. And it was a deliberate ploy. And he said, you know, life is not for discovering who you are. Life is for creating yourself and getting on with the reason you were here, which, as he said, was to, 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 to create a better world. He was a, uh, an inveterate world betterer, unrepentant world betterer. Whereas others were enslaved and worked hard all their life for a pittance and lived and died in poverty. I knew there was something wrong here. And I find myself so much in sympathy with his ideas and his views and his values um, as to feel that it's quite natural. It's not, it's not acting in that sense. Even if this whole world, this whole universe, this whole existence was just an accident, a pure chance, without purpose or meaning, just a joke? Wouldn't you do your utmost to make it the best possible joke rather than a bad one? I would, and I did. The process of challenging people, because I believe the theatre is not there just for entertainment, although it is important that you entertain people, but as Shaw knew, he would knew he wanted he would entertain people to get their attention so that he could then... Uh, put his ideas across, and I feel that I'm doing, I suppose, something of the same as he would have done through him in that in that way, and I find a great deal of um, satisfaction in that. <laughs>